I bought every fake iPhone 14, starting with this one. Oh my god. Wait, why does this look kind of fancy? It's in like a white fancy box. This one might actually be nice. See what it looks like. <laughs> no way. Look at this. Ooh, sheesh. Dang, this looks kind of nice. It literally looks like an iPhone 14 gold. Dude, wait, this is kind of cool. Okay, let's see what's inside this fake iPhone 14 box. Oh my gosh, it literally comes with a screen protector, an iPhone case, a headphone. Dang, dude, this phone gives me more than Apple. We literally have wired headphones in here. We also have a charger. Okay, wow, this thing comes with everything. All right, let's test her out. This is what she looks like. Wow. This is what the first fake iPhone 14 looks like, and I have to say, it looks actually pretty darn good. Like, if I were to see this in someone's hand, there's no way I would know that it was a fake iPhone. Well, except for, like, there's no Apple logo, but that's not that important anyways. Okay, well, let's go ahead and turn it on and see if this thing looks like an iPhone. That definitely giving me iPhone vibes, I feel like. Right? Welcome. Wow. <laughs> Powered by Android. Ooh, okay. Okay, we bougie. Look at this. It's got the whole Apple background and everything. Wallpapers and widgets. Okay, it literally kind of is acting like a Galaxy phone. It's trying to be like an iPhone looking thing, but it's very Galaxy. Let's see how this thing works. I feel like the only thing that's making this look like an iPhone is the background and like the casing of it. Like I have to say, like the outsides of it looks really real. You can see like the gold little outside. You see like the gold around the camera. I thought it was gonna maybe be kind of like a fake iPhone 14, but other than the look of it, it's literally just the same exact exact thing as a galaxy. It's so slow, what the heck? Look, it's all bugged out. Oh my gosh, it's so buggy. Okay, so it sounds okay. Oops. It's like so buggy, what's going on? It was like almost super nice, but it's like so buggy. Oh my gosh, what? So this is what a real iPhone 14 looks and this is what our fake iPhone 14 looks like. I have to say, it honestly looked pretty dang close. I'm not mad about that, that looks pretty good. Except the volume is not even on the right side. But you know what, that, that doesn't matter. I think this one, not bad. It really tried to look like an iPhone and it worked, but not very well. So I'm gonna have to give this fake iPhone 14 probably a six out of 10. Stop it. Let's see our next fake iPhone iPhone 14. Ooh, this one comes in a black, but oh, okay. Kind of fancy, look at it. Ooh, tell me that's not bougie, dude. It's like a black iPhone box, so bougie. Love to see it. Oh, this is blue. Okay. Wait, this actually looks kind of good. What the heck? Ooh, baby. Ooh, baby. Oh, and it's got like a little shiny on the side. This blue actually looks kind of pretty. Like, I need to know in the comments down below, like, do you guys think that if you saw this phone, would you know that it was fake? Because I feel like at first glance, I really wouldn't be able to tell. But the front is obviously not as good. Inside the box, we have chargers, and it comes with an iPhone case. It seems like the fake iPhones come with more stuff than the real iPhone. Like, Apple should be giving us iPhone cases too. That's all I'm gonna say. But this is what the outside of the iPhone looks like. Like, and I have to say, it looks pretty good. Look at this, if I put them together like that, I would think that this is just two iPhone 14. The sides are not exactly the same, but you know, they're trying, they're really trying. The front, obviously, <laughs> is a little bit different, but what will really truly tell is when we turn it on. Let's see what it looks like. Again with the welcome, love it. I got this fake iPhone 14 from Amazon for $99. So let's see what a $99 phone can get us. Hey, it looks pretty nice when you first open it. Okay, it looks like an Apple layout, like they put all the apps like to make it look like it was like an Apple phone. They tried to like make the apps like a normal Apple phone, but like I said, it's not, it's not looking that good. Let's see if this camera looks better than the other one. No, oh my God, it looks way worse. This camera looks so bad. Dude, look at this. Oh, it actually looks better when it's taken. Wow, wait, wait, this is kind of nice. Hey, should I use this one instead of my other iPhone 14? This one was a lot cheaper, let me tell you that. Okay, so the camera's actually not bad. Let's see if it can like function right. Okay, so let's try out my favorite app, YouTube, of course. I'm like doing anything on this phone and it's like taking five hours. Look at that. I literally clicked YouTube and it's like, oh, wait, I'm trying to open the app. Look. The audio sounds like really bad. It doesn't look horrible, but it definitely doesn't look good either. And the audio is just really bad. Let's see if we can jam out with this phone. That's the loudest it goes. So this phone is definitely not the best. I thought that the outside looked really cute. We did spend like $99 on this. So like I expected it to be better. Oh, they have TikTok. The amount of time that it takes to start up an app is crazy. What did I pay $99 for? This thing is a piece of junk. This has to be probably the worst phone I've ever unboxed. Look at it. What is it doing? Adidas fits for different dates. This is so bad. 
Oh my god, this phone is really, really bad. I can't do anything on this phone, literally. I was gonna say that this phone is pretty good and it was pretty, pretty nice, but it literally does not work. I'm gonna have to give this iPhone a two out of 10 because you can't really do anything on it other than 10, you have an iPhone 14. This one is so bad. Time for our next fake iPhone 14. This one is a little weird. Like, I really don't understand how this is an iPhone, but we're about to find out right now. This is the weirdest iPhone packaging I've ever seen. Okay, I mean, cool. Okay, wow. It has its own little sections for the charger. The C21 Pro. Oh my goodness. All right, let's see what this one actually looks like. Oh my gosh, this is funny. What is this? It has a case on it already. Okay, that's so what the front looks like. All right, I mean, it doesn't look anywhere near like the other ones we opened today, but it's a different vibe, it's a different vibe. Here it is next to the iPhone 14. This one looks a little goofy, funny goofy, and I think you could definitely tell that this one is fake when you're looking at it. You're just like, hold up, wait a minute, something ain't looking right here, something's not right. But let's turn it on and see what it looks like on the inside. It's the inside that matters, not the outside, guys. Wow, okay, okay. I can't, I can't tell. I bought this fake iPhone 14 for $99. That's kind of a lot. This thing better work pretty good. It's a pretty color though. I feel like the blue is really nice. This one looks kind of cool because it has like the little camera in the corner, but it doesn't give iPhone. Giving a different phone. Like, but I mean, hey, it kind of looks better than the iPhone. Look at that. This one actually looks really good. Which only makes me think that the camera is going to look really good too. Dang, this one actually looks pretty good. Like, I feel like this is probably the best one we've seen so far. What's up, guys? We are on my new iPhone 14. This is what it looks like. I like how the camera actually looks like an iPhone. Like, the bottom part of it looks like, like an iPhone camera. Why does it look better than my real iPhone 14? Are we getting scammed right now? Wait, that actually looks really good. Dang, I'm actually super surprised with this one. I was kind of talking smack because it looks a little goofy. If it works, it works, you know? It has the same apps as the Apple, too. Like, it has the same icon. It's got a whole calculator. I mean, obviously, you can tell that it's an Android because Apple doesn't have this on here or anything like that but hey if it works it works I feel like the graphics on this one is probably the best too like doesn't it look crispy wait I'm actually like really liking this one wait a minute this one works really well it's actually working when I touch it and the camera doesn't look bad what do we think guys should I switch to this Oikatel over my iPhone 14 I just might this one's probably the best iPhone 14 we've seen so far this one's gonna get a 9 out of 10 other than the fact that it doesn't exactly look like an iPhone 14 time for our next iPhone 14 I have good hopes for this one I just have really high hopes for it. Look. Ooh, it's in a white box. <laughs> I was so excited. Why does it look like that? I don't remember ordering a green iPhone. What the heck is this? You know what? Who knows? Maybe inside the box, there's just this amazing iPhone 14. Now, I ain't never been with a bag. Oh my god, what is that? Oh, they're getting worse and worse as we go on. Oh my god, I took off the back on accident. Oh no. Let's see what else we get in the box. We have a case. Again, the charger is cool. Great. Very nice so far. I'm impressed. This one is probably the worst looking iPhone that we've gotten so far. It's like a skinny little iPhone with like a skinny little camera. Maybe this one will work better than the rest of them. I thought we were going to get a real iPhone here. What the heck? Okay, so this phone looks almost the exact same as all the other ones that we've done. Except like the apps look a little bit different and we have a little purple background on it. Um, but this one's actually working pretty good too because it's literally actually working when I tell it to work. Look at this dude. My asshole. <laughs> <laughs> I like this camera. I think it makes me look really pretty. Let's try to play some games on this phone. Let's see if it can handle it. Okay, looks like it's working. Okay, cool. Wait, this is actually working pretty well, that, better than I thought. The other ones were so glitchy, like you couldn't even play games on it. Hey, we're done with this game. <laughs> How do I get off of this game? <laughs> it's still going. <laughs> So this iPhone is not too shabby. I think it actually works pretty well. And the only thing is it really doesn't look like an iPhone 14 to me. I definitely think this is probably one of the worst ones that we bought today, but at least it works. Time for our next iPhone 14. Oh my gosh. The same one. I bought like four. Why did they send me two? Did I get scammed? They sent me two iPhone 14. I said I bought every fake iPhone 14, didn't I? Okay. <laughs> I accidentally bought three of the same. So we have our big iPhone 14 giveaway. So I accidentally bought three of these same exact fake iPhone 14s. You got anything to say about that? I bought too many fake iPhones. <laughs> 
Tesla's buying every fake iPhone 14. If you guys like this video, please give it a big old thumbs up and let me know in the comments down below which one was the best fake iPhone 14. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!